guys welcome back to my channel i'm actually here with a, another unboxing um the uh beginning of this month was actually my birthday and i decided to get myself um some things um actually just these two things but um i wanted to get uh, well, let me show you. Um, so this just came today right now. I wanted to show you guys before I even opened it. I am doing this part one-handed, uh, so bear with me. Um, this first part, I've actually been waiting for them to come back into stock just because I alternate between planners. Um, this is the 2021 inserts for pocket size. And then the I also got the 2021 inserts for personal size so i am gonna open um actually i'm not gonna open these just because this is literally all it is maybe i'll show you the lines later but originally they're uh 37.95 but um and then this one is normally 27.95 but they were on sale so i think i got this one for like 20 bucks and this one i got for 30 bucks so it was like 10 bucks off so that's what that looks like. Um, it's lined weeklies with month on two pages. So it's very simple and that I can refer to. Um, I mainly got this one because I have a pocket size and I don't use it. Um, it's a relatively expensive pocket and I don't use it because I don't have inserts for 2021. And I kind of, I didn't really have inserts for 2020. Um, just some crappy ones that I just didn't care for, hence me not using it. So I decided to splurge for my, for my birthday and get these. Okay, so I saw this bag maybe last month and the color I wanted ran out. They had it in black and they had it in a nice blue, which I also was tempted to get because I don't have any blue ba bags. Didn't get the black because I have tons of bag black bags. And again, I paid full price for this. Well, actually it was on a little bit of a sale. I think it was like 50 bucks off. Um, string from the... Look at how pretty that is. I'm, it's more pretty in person than on film. Okay, so really quickly, I'm gonna tell you the name of the bag. There is the slip, here it is. So it's called the Any Day Medium Shoulder Bag in mineral gray. And so again, this gray has like almost like a purple undertone. I can't describe it. It's a really, really pretty gray. I'll try to see. Let me see if I can get it on film real quick. Mm, kind of there is pretty close, but there's more purple into this. So it's so pretty. Okay, so let me get into the details of the bag. So this does have a long strap. And I'll put the stats. And look how pretty that is. And then another thing that they have, uh, or it has, are these two zipper pulls. And what they're supposed to make is a book, which it is so pretty. So there's that. It has the Kate Spade logo in the front. And then it has two like bag charms, I guess. And it can go one more. Like, but look at the two bag charms. So it has a tassel and a purple Kate Spade and gold stamped leather um, uh, spade. There's nothing in the back. I might go in and put my initials in here at like the outlet, they have a hot stamp or a... So there's that. There's no feet, no back pocket. It's a very simple bag, which I like. The piping is white, which I thought was very unique. It has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
nine nine holes here i'll i'll tell you the, the stats in just a second what i really liked about it is that it's a thin strap that kind of goes into a thicker strap on the other side Okay, so this is a little bit better of a view, but yeah. Um, and what's interesting is, I don't know if you could tell, but the side has a, goes down a little bit, which I really like. It gives you a little bit of a wider opening. So it feels, it's not... It doesn't feel like cotton lining. It feels like almost felt. A microfiber almost. So it has a back pocket with a clasp. You can put like maybe a mini tablet or your phone in there, which is what I'm probably going to do. Um, and it has a leather uh, clasp with a spade on it. And then it has a back zipper with a leather pull on it as a care card. And then what this is. So that's what that looks like in here. And then on the opposite side, it has um, another pocket with just a uh, leather trimming. That's another way you can tell if your bag is boutique or if it's an outlet item. A lot of times um, outlet items don't have um, the leather trimming. The inside, I've never had a bag this, this nice. Um, I have my Michael Kors Rhea backpack and that one is absolutely gorgeous, but um, this one, I don't know. There's just something very delicate and feminine about it that i really like and the reason why i got this bag is because i don't have anything like this i like the one shoulder bag and i like the fact let me move this back i like the fact that this is one shoulder and how big this is again i'll put up the measurements for you but i hardly ever see a set like um one one strap satchel like this as big as this is i could fit a lot of things in here let me see <laughs> i absolutely destroyed one here's a letter size piece of paper so a letter size piece of paper is about the size of this thing for the front so and then this is my the personal inserts that i got in comparison to comparison to this thing so it sh that should give you this is personal size so that should give you a little bit of an inkling of the measurements i'll take some pictures and stuff and hopefully capture the purple that's in here but it's really pretty so i hope you guys have enjoyed my video make sure you hit that like button as well as that subscription and bell notification so that you get notified every single time i upload a video um